hi welcome to this sql server video tutorial in this video i'm going to write a simple select query that will return the total revenue by brand therefore let's get started and before we go further remember to hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon to be notified of new videos i'm going to demo this first and foremost in excel and then we'll come back to the sql and write the query let's head over to excel now in Excel, we have the same data set already in the SQL Server Management Studio. Now this data in Excel has been formatted as an Excel table and we have created our named ranges. Let's go to the report sheet. Now we have all this unique brand and let's run the sum ifs, a single criteria to calculate the total revenue for each of the brand. Equal sign, sum ifs, press my tab key. Sum range is going to be the total revenue comma criteria range one we need a brand name range comma and for the criteria one i'm going to provide this direct cell reference for each of this unique brand so click on a to close parenthesis control enter and then we'll send it out with the auto field now for the under we have 579 million six seven three thousand plus as the total revenue and let's go to sql and do the same thing over here i'm going to write the um, query so let's start select now i need the brand column so i'm going to say brand then comma then i'm going to use the sum aggregate function open parenthesis and i want to sum the total revenue now the total revenue is a combination of two words i'm going to put that inside square bracket so square bracket total revenue close the square bracket and then I close the sum and I'm going to put in an alias as the title. Let me just call that total underscore rev. And then I'm going to provide the name of the table, which is the sales um, report table. And then I'm going to use the group by feature. So, okay, group by. So I'm going to group by the same brand. Okay, now everything is looking good. Okay, okay, there's a need for E here. So it has to be spelled accurate okay this code now let's run this cool so we have this for under five seven six million six seven three thousand exactly what we achieved in excel here but you discover that this is not formatted in a particular currency now to apply the currency i'm going to just wrap in a format function inside it outside the sum calculation open parenthesis now let's come right here comma now i'm just going to put inside the single code C okay, and that will give me the specified currency in my regional settings, and everything is looking good. Select everything again, execute. Cool, we have it formatted as an Excel with a currency rather. So we have five seven nine million plus. Now let's check for bike. The bike total revenue is six nine seven million six eight five thousand plus. Let's come here. Now let's see the bike. Okay, cool. We have six nine seven six eight five thousand plus. Cool. So this is essentially how we can write the query that can return the total revenue by brand. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, again share with your friend, like, comment, and subscribe because there's a lot to come. Bye for now. Cheers.